back to South Kakalaki Basin. Today, me and Little Kakalaki. Hi. We're going to go out and try to catch some crappy today. I uh, had a good day yesterday on the lake, but I didn't take my cameras with me. So today, we're going to go out and try to film a little bit. Uh, it's going to be an overcast day, so the, the bite may be different. Uh, little Kakalaki is going to be on the camera most of the time today. So mm -hmm. you're probably not going to see him very much. But uh, hopefully we're going to get out here and catch some. I'll show you how I'm doing it, what I'm using to do it with. And uh, anybody who's struggling to catch crappie this time of year, it is probably the last video I'm going to make this year because it's December 30th. So last time I get to go fishing this year. Uh, maybe the next video after this will be in January, which this probably won't go out until January either. But This will be the last trip for 2022. It's been a pretty good year for fishing. And uh, I'm hoping 2023 is going to be even better. So, y'all stay with us. Another good one. a little bit after right after you lost it too <clears throat> not too many 
here next. Another good one. Toby Jordan at 5 baits. And then this one's made by Wade Burdett. It's called Neon Melon. It's one I use most of the time. It's a double rig, 1 ounce jig heads, sickle hook, number 7 split shot right there. About 18 inches apart. Rolling on, I changed over to 10 pound braid with 6 pound four part on my Omega medium light rod, fast action. That's what I'm doing, now I'm catching them all. Minnows just ain't working for me. Get back to it. Yeah, you know that's a keeper. Yes. Best one yet. Yes, sir. That'd be a good picture. All right. Another one. Switched over that smaller jig. Will they tear it up? Heck yeah. At least you count them though. Golly. Is that a brim? No. Oh. Get a picture of that. Alright. Look at that though, camera. Tiny. Can't tell, is that one? Oh yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that is definitely a keeper, ain't it? That, is that the biggest one yet? No, the other one was bigger. You should have saw him struggle. You should have struck. You should have saw him struggle earlier. Oh, let's go. That's the darn hammer right here. Whew. That's what I like to see. That one's going to be pushing two pounds right there. Okay. Pounds three quarter. <laughs> Golly. Look at there. Everybody left us. Yeah. Big girl starting to eat again. 
put up a fight too. Mm-hmm. They start biting again. Nice one. Now that is a really good one. Mm-hmm. If this video gets 200 likes or more, I'll come back as the cameraman again. Keeper. Oh no. Yeah. Oh, we saved him. <laughs> Oh, he saved them. Let's go. Keeper. Last one, and it's a keeper. Twenty fish. Twenty fish. Good enough. Twenty keepers, and we caught more than that. Today. Yeah. So now we got ten and ten. All right, everybody. That's gonna be it for today. We caught twenty fish uh, and twenty in the live well. But we caught more than that. Uh, I did all the fishing today. Rylan done all the videoing. Cause that's what I like. That's what he likes. That's what he wants to do. So, uh, um, I hopefully for now on, Rylan will get to be my cameraman when he gets to go. But it's been a beautiful day out here on the lake. It's starting to get a little breezy as the front moving in. But we caught all the fish today on a, that double rig jig. I caught a few on minnows, but not very many. Uh, I showed that earlier on in the video on how I rigged that or how, how I got it set up. But, but uh. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please do give us that thumbs up. And um, like we always say, if you ain't out fishing, you need to be. That's right. You need to be. Until next time, until 2023, we'll be seeing you next year. Y'all take care. Thanks for watching.